Hi OTC, it's me again. Now, last video we did arms. This one we're focusing on legs. So it's still an AMRAP um, workout. So we've got five goblet squats, five split lunges, and they're gonna be each side, and then five one leg deadlifts, meaning five each side, and then five um, front loaded squats or loaded front squats. So I'll show you this workout. Now again, use the weight accordingly to your fitness level and a good warm up prior to this. Now you can do the arm video uh, in conjunction with the leg. I would just look about, you know, look at your time and don't go 45 minutes or something like that. Um, we've probably all not been working out as much as we have been. I know I haven't. So you really don't want to go too heavy, too fast. Uh, so you really need to listen to what your body is saying and slow it down if need be, or put your weights down. All right, so five goblet squats. So I'm gonna show you that. So a goblet squat, we've got a wider stance than our shoulders. All right, and you, the key is to keep that weight in the center, and you wanna keep your back straight and head up. So when you're doing a squat, you should never be leaning over. You should always be straight up. So imagine we've got a pole running down our back, and we wanna keep that position uh, nice and straight. So feet are out a little bit wider than shoulders. Toes, not quite straight forward, a little angle to those, okay? And here is my weight. Now this would be a good one for a kettlebell if you have one. If not, you can take a weight or anything that you have at the house and just hold it down in front of you. Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Good, now next we've got our split lunges. So I'm gonna start with my right foot in the front and then my left foot behind me. Now you wanna make sure you've got good footing on this. You see I'm not working out with shoes. I'm actually more comfortable without tennis shoes at times. Um, so weights on both sides. Now you can put the weights down if you'd like. A little less of a challenge, but again, nothing wrong with that. All right, so here we go. One, two, three, four, five, and I'm switching legs. Right is in the back, left is forward. Again, grounding that back foot, making sure you've got a good foot position. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. All right, now I'm putting one weight down and we're going to be doing our one leg deadlift. Now you might want a spot for stability for this uh, because you don't want to fall over, of course. So I'm going to use this table. You can use a wall or whatever. So my weight's in my right hand, so I'm going back with my left. Now you're going to feel this in your hamstring all the way down to your calf. Uh, so you want to make sure you've got a good form. I'm just bending it over. One, two, three, four, five, and switch. One, two, keep the head up. Three, four, five. Good. Now, next one is gonna be a front load. So this one's a little bit different. So I'm gonna put the weights right up on my shoulders and just keep them up here, all right? Now again, Listen to your body. This is a lot of weight, so don't go this heavy if you're not used to it. Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so that was your leg workout for the day. Like I said, you can do this in conjunction with the arm workout and get a full body workout in. So look forward to another abs workout this week and probably a hit. So hope you're doing well. Hope to see you soon. Love and miss you guys. Ciao.